All right, let's go ahead and start to use some of the basic adjustments for editing uh, and developing our images in Lightroom. So I'm going to go over to the left, and we're going to go up to the library module. Now let's go to the folder Photos under Viewing. I'm going to select the folder, select the photo, and jump into Develop. And what we're going to do now is we're going to come down and look at the tabs for basic editing of color. So first, I have my white balance tool. And the way to use the white balance tool is something in the picture is supposed to be white. You can find something in the picture that's supposed to be white or neutral gray. You can click on that white balance tool and click and reset it. And so in this case, that's probably accurate, but I actually liked it better with it kind of mysterious with the, the cool blues and, and so on, but that may be uh, more accurate. I'm going to undo that. Backslash. Um, in addition to that, I have my temperature sliders, and the idea is that I can drag those around and make it warmer or cooler. And you can see the histogram adjusting as I modify it. And then the tint, which is either going to push the image more towards the green or more towards the purple. So that's really it. Anytime I get these sliders discombobulated, I can just double click on the slider itself and it'll go back. And I can also click on the slider and then use the up and down arrow keys on my keyboard to move the sliders along. So I can click on the slider and tap up and down on the slider and adjust the slider by clicking up and down on it. I also have the ability to shoot as shot or make an auto adjustment or a custom adjustment to the image. And that's my basic temperature and tone adjustments. Now, what about exposure? Exposure simply makes the image darker or brighter. It's adjusting everything at the same time. Contrast introduces more differences between the image. And less contrast makes the image softer or sharper, more clarity inside the image. Highlights only affect the lightest parts of the picture. I'm only adjusting the lightest part elements. Shadows are the parts in the picture that are darker but not black. White, so the actual white part of the picture, you can see that I've got the highlight clipping on. And so when the red turns on, it means that it's blown out. Blacks are the actual blacks that are inside of that image. Let's stop there, come back and work on the next set of sliders in a second.